big deal if you like and subscribe. Oh, pew, 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 pew. I mean, technically, it's iguana, but I think that they mean for us to say iguana. Hey, kid. Hey, Green Bear, Dark Dinosaur. Oh, oh, oh. Hi, Storyteller. Hey, we gotta figure something out. Pronunciation issues, I take it? Yeah, yeah. So, if you look at the title, it says iguana be a dragon. But we can tell that it's really like a play on words. Ah, yes, a play on words. And, and I think that it's supposed to say iguana be a dragon. Like, I wanna be a dragon. Well, I suspect that both pronunciations are probably spot on. Yeah, yeah, so we can be creative. I wanna be a dragon. Iguana be a dragon. <laughs> it's a really funny title. I know. But why does Iguana wanna be a dragon? Or I wanna be a dragon, you know what I mean. But why, why? What's wrong with being an iguana? Ah, I don't know. You know what? I feel like this is a quirky book. We should look under the cover. You know how I like to look under the cover to see if anything new is going on under there that we're not expecting from the front cover? So there's, I just wanted, hey, my suspicions were correct. This is the scaly skin of an iguana, or maybe a dragon, I really can't tell for sure. But look, it's already different, and then it's different on this side from this, oh, oh, there's gonna be a pool party, and coming, not coming, you know we're coming. We love a good party. And it's a pool party at Cheetah's house. And the one with a balloon. Okay, got it, got it? Okay, let's go. We have a party to attend to. So, oh, I like already. These are called the end papers, I think, which is funny because they're also at the beginning. And it's already starting to tell us a story, shall we? So here we are in the neighborhood. Remember we saw that invitation that said that the party at Cheetah's house is where the balloon is? Boom, there it is. And then, and then, oh, looks like we just sold the house and it's the pattern that we saw here, uh-huh. So I think Iguana moved in here. Is that, that's what we're putting together, right? With the pictures that's telling us a story. And then there are other people who live in the neighborhood. Carrot, I'm thinking a rabbit lives there. And cheese, I'm thinking some sort of a rodent lives there. And ooh, an acorn, I bet that a squirrel of some kind lives there. Maybe a bird here on this one. Oh yeah, I'm already enjoying the story before the story. I wanna, I wanna be a dragon. Oh look, moving in, sold, sure enough, there it is. And got the furniture and the boxes. Moving himself in, so exciting when you move into a new place, you get to decorate and meet new people. Iguana had just moved into a new house. Look, hanging up the pictures, and there are, oh, having a little pizza, because who has time to cook when you have to unpack boxes of lamps, and pictures, and curtains, and movies, and cassettes, cassettes, really, cassettes, and he's playing the tunes to pass the time away while he's decorating, and I love the lava lamp, but he's bringing in some greenery for freshness and oxygen, and oh, and he had mail. You're invited to a pool party! 2 p.m., Cheetah's house, the one with the balloon. We knew that. Please RSVP, coming, not coming. You know we're coming. And he paced, pace, pace, pace. He stared, what's going on here? He had never been to a pool party before. <gasps> oh, but, but that wasn't the problem. Problem. I wonder what the problem is. Maybe he needs a bathing suit. Yeah, that must be it. He needs a bathing suit, and it's probably in a box. Yeah, I guess to go find it. Yeah. Good theory. Let's see what's going on. Cheetahs are the fastest animals in the world. That's right. The invitation has come by cheetah, fastest. Ta -da! That makes them amazing. What if there were other amazing animals at the party? I can drink 30 gallons of water in 10 minutes. Okay, okay camel. My tail is actually like another arm. Okay, monkey. I use four tentacles to experience my environment. All right, slug. I release odor, dude. Ooh, don't like that amazing talent. He made a checklist. Iguanas are green, ding. They enjoy the sun, Ching. Don't forget your scale screen SPF 100. And they're green. Bing. Wait a minute. I think we covered green and green. Oh, are we having? He's feeling insecure. Oh, 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 I understand. Listen, Iguana, do not worry. You are amazing in your own way. 
Thank you, Doug, for that pep talk. I think Iguana's gonna feel better now. I am not amazing! Oh no, we're having a complete self-confidence crisis here. Oh, poor guy. Maybe he could come up with something to really wow the crowd. A little painting. Playing the recorder. Keep, keep practicing on that, bud. And, oh, doing some spoon balancing. Very exotic. Or he could just sit this one out. Not coming. What? No! He wasn't really in the mood to go swimming anyway. I don't believe that for a second. Me neither. Then, out of nowhere, boom, he got a sign. Boom. Like, literally, a sign. Gasp! Dragons are amazing! It's from Dragon Donuts, now open. Ooh, dragons are amazing and donuts are amazing, but what does that have to do with being an iguana? He made another checklist. Okay. Dragons can fly. Amazing! King! They have magical horns for doing magical things. Magic, magic, magic. Very amazing. Ching. They shoot blazing fire out of their mouths. Extremely amazing. Ching. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, that is the part I do not like because even though I am half dragon, I feel more like a dinosaur because I do not like to breathe fire. It is too hot. So he went straight to Sweet Deal's thrift shop to find something that would make him look like a dragon. Oh, okay, there's a fitting room. A little bit of everything in this shop. Ooh, costume stuff, a dollar each. Bargain. What does he have there? Oh, that's gonna be some interesting stuff. Let's see what he works up. Uh, no. Oh, but honestly, I like that one. And no. Oh, I like that one, that one's cool. No. Oh, I like that one. Uh, maybe? Mm, no, 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 definitely not. Boop. Tie, 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 tie. Looks like he's getting inventive here. What do we have here? <gasps> Ta-da! Perfect! I have to hand it to Iguana. He took two party hats, two kites, and turned it into a dragon costume? I'm impressed. I am. Thunk. Well, he would just have to uh, get used to it. There was just one thing missing. The fire! Ooh. First, he tried some vegetarian chili. Careful, it's spicy. All right, we've been warned. So the vegetarian chili. Next, some buffalo cauliflower. I'm hot just saying that. To finish, the I'm feeling hot, 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 spicy kale kebabs. Wow, he can eat all that? Iguana breathe. <laughs> No fire. <laughs> Still nothing. And then he felt it. Tweet, 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 tweet. Almost like uh Whoa! He soared! He glided! He's turning very red! He was hot! Too hot! He spun out of control. Zhoop. He saw a pool in the distance. Zhoop. And brace for landing. Look out below! He's gonna hit that pool, which thank goodness there's a pool there. And, oh, did you notice that this is a house with the balloon? This isn't just any pool and any house. This is the party house. And here we go! Splash! He swam as fast as he could to cool down. And everybody's watching like, little did he know that he had landed right in the middle of a race at Cheetah's pool party. Whoa, this guy came out of nowhere. He's cruising. He's like a tiny torpedo. Wow, he is amazing. Don't you think? Cheetah was impressed. Wow, you are an amazing swimmer. I'm so glad you came. Oh, um, <laughs> thanks. Me too. As it turned out, there were a lot of amazing things about Iguana. Let's hear it. He was an excellent climber. 
Thank goodness he could get the ball that got stuck up there during the game. He told hilarious jokes. And then the frog said, Pineapple! Ha 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 ha! hilarious! <laughs> he was really good at hide and seek. <gasps> because they can change their color. Check it out! Another amazing thing about iguanas. Iguanas are really amazing. Have you seen them in person? They're like, they're like, they're like dinosaurs, but then tiny, and they crawl, and they're fast, just like the iguana in this book was such a fast swimmer. And he was super thoughtful, got the chips and dip. Thanks, dude. Iguana didn't need to worry so much about fitting in. Meanwhile, everyone's floaty is on point. The flamingo on the flamingo, the sloth on the burger, the rabbit and the squirrel on the shark, and the pizza panda. Oh yeah, they really know how to pool party. He just needed to be himself. And that is pretty amazing. But you probably knew that all along, didn't you? Iguana just had to figure it out for himself. Yeah, I totally understand. Sometimes I, I, I wanted to be something even more amazing than Green Bear. No way. Yeah, way. Sometimes I wanted to be like a giant panda bear. Really? Yeah, because it looked like a Oreo cookie, which is pretty delicious. Oh, that is very true. And then I sometimes wish I could be gigantic like a tree. But I am happy being Doug the Dinosaur because that means that I have great friends like you. Yeah, and Doug the Dinosaur has the biggest heart, and we all just have to figure out what makes us all special. And I'm really glad that Iguana figured it out. Me too, because Iguana is pretty cool and very creative with the whole costume. Yeah, that is really true. That's true. So, you can be creative, you could swim fast, you can catch things, you could be super caring. There's so many ways to be amazing, aren't there? But honestly, I already think you're pretty amazing. Yeah, because you are our friend. <laughs>